Mashiach Year of the Tenth Red Heifer and Mashiach 5783 by Karl Yehuda ben Gedi or Sages teach us that only nine red heifers have been sanctified to Hashem. First, by Moses himself, have them bring a red heifer to create the purification ashes. The second was in the times of the prophet Ezra for Solomon's temple, to Hashem a red heifer was sanctified to make the ashes. And then onwards as needed, seven more were sanctified to Hashem to produce the purification ashes to purify one's consciousness connection to Hashem. Our sages have also promised us that the tenth red heifer will be done in the times of the Mashiach. May he be speedily revealed in this year of 5783, may it be God's will. One could ask a very important question. Does this mean if the Mashiach has not been revealed as our king? That the tenth red heifer cannot be sanctified to Hashem? And my own personal opinion only. Even if this should be the case, he must in fact be alive right now and will be helped by divine providence to at least returned and living in Israel. So one can argue that once this event of the red heifer sanctification and ashes produced, it would be proof positive of the Mashiach existence and is now living in Israel. To then trigger the next phase in his mission as the rightful heir to kingship, bringing about the transformation from the state of Israel to the kingdom of Israel, which would in my opinion only be modeled on the United Kingdom model, at least for a probation period of say up to 40 years, to allow the nation of Israel to learn and become accustomed to the Mashiach era unfolding today.